Hello all, welcome to yet another interesting demo of our attack defense labs. So one set of interesting challenges we've added is actually offensive Python. And we are adding newer categories. Now we all love Python. And what we've done is we picked up interesting libraries which we think you as pen testers, red blue teamers should know about. Uh, so I'll give you a simple example. So let's say file metadata. So here is one challenge uh, to actually go ahead and pick up interesting metadata from PDF files. So let's go ahead, start this challenge. And as you can see, it clearly mentions in OSINT, picking up metadata is interesting. Uh, we have a bunch of PDF files in here and a couple of questions so that you can go ahead and write code and pick up metadata from these files. So we are running a Jupyter Python notebook here. Uh, some of you may have used it. If not, we've given a link here so you can know the basics of Jupyter. So it also tells you the file name is challenge three. So this is actually going to open up your own dedicated Jupyter notebook. And here are the challenges. We have a PDF folder inside which we have a bunch of PDFs. And there you go. So after this, you have a bunch of tasks which asks you about, you know, different metadata, you know, pick up the authors, pick up other fields and whatnot. Now, these are practice challenges. So we've also provided the solution so that once you try on your own, you can go ahead and pick it up. So we've used a, uh, a library called PyPDF2. And once you've done it your way, you can go ahead and look at our solution and see how we've done it, right? So apart from metadata, we also have other interesting categories like password cracking. You know, we have zip PDF uh, and all of this stuff. We have PCAP analysis under offensive Python as well. We also have server attacks where basically you're attacking SSH servers doing brute forcing, FTP servers, automatic logging in and whatnot. So I'd highly recommend looking at this section, trying out the different challenges and seeing if you can learn something interesting from them. Thank you.